Yo, what's up, guys? Joey back with a video. Today, I'm going to show you how to make Travis Scott type beat in 10 minutes. With that being said, let's get started. First, I'm going to start with um, the chords. As I've set the tempo to 122 beats per minute. So let's draw the chords. So I'm gonna copy this by holding shift. So now let's insert this pattern into the playlist. So I have I have already linked all the channels into the mixer tab. So let's introduce a gross beat. And I've see uh, I'm seeing some low ends, so I'm cutting that with fruity parameter EQ2. So I'm gonna use the uh, root notes as the bass. So I'm using silent one for creating bass for the intro. So let's extend this up to the up to two bars. So let's uh, start the sound design for bass. So I'm using saw saw tooth wave. Um, Eight voices, re-trigger off, and slightly detuned, and the same uh, saw saw waves. Eight voices, trigger off, and slightly detuned. So I'm gonna use a bandpass filter. So I'm gonna reduce the octave to minus two. So this is the dark bass I need. So I'm going to use the LFO one to create a movement in the cutoff and the resonance of A. I'm setting the gain about half and the rate to one and set it to free mode. So it sounds good to me. Let's introduce a pretty parametric EQ to cut some of the highs. So let's introduce a camel crusher to crank up the bass. So I'm gonna use the preset tube warmth. So, uh, adding drums will take time. So, I've already added the drums. So, now I've already included the drums with bells, cymbals, and some uh, hi hat rolls. So, let's make a piano melody. This will run in the background.
so let's lower the volume and let's cut some of the low end in the piano so let's create another melody this will act sorry so let's create uh, a chord progression using brass So let's lower the volume and let's cut some of the low end frequencies. So let's introduce into the playlist. So let's add another melody as a top line top line melody So let's insert this into the playlist. So I'm gonna layer the top line melody with another uh, synth from Nexus. So I'm using uh, presets from Nexus under plug. So I'm gonna automate the cutoff frequency of Nexus. So after adding some automations um, from the cutoff frequency and the cross beat, so this is the result. So I'm gonna add a tape stop effect to the master track. So I'll link the download link in the description. So this is going to be the final result guys. Thanks for watching guys, um, I'll leave the link for the FLP in the description, make sure you check that out and once again thanks for watching guys, it's Jovi signing out. That's a lot. We heard it. Now we are hearing the kick. Kick may not be this loud, so I'm going to reduce the volume.